game in the NBA versus the real opportunity in this year's draft. Missed the real chance to have some fun. You knew Bronny James wasn't going to get drafted in the first round. Heck, he should not have been drafted at all. So some schmucko team like Charlotte with the 12th pick in the second round, Charlotte should have taken Bronny before the Lakers did to screw LeBron. And then Charlotte said to the Lakers, we'll trade Jabroni so he can play with Daddy. We want five first-round picks for Bronny. If you don't give that to us, we keep him. And we will not cut him no matter what, and we won't put him on the court either. He'll just sit and stew at the end of the bench forever. So if you want to play with your kid, LeBron, pay up because you're 39 years old and we will wait you out. And if LeBron bitches, Charlotte says, okay, now it's six first round picks. And if LeBron says, well, when I play you, I'm going to score 70 points and you're going to lose big. Charlotte could say, yeah, that, that happens a lot anyway. I'd love it. I'd love it if Charlotte would have done that. LeBron runs the NBA. Charlotte, whoever would have done it, they'd just be taking some back. Bronny shouldn't be in the NBA. It's ridiculous. It's 100% Nepo, and not enough people say so. And wait until the first highlight of son assisting a bucket by dad or vice versa. All of sports media will orgasm simultaneously, which I think is a myth that that never happens. Bronny got asked if his dad's still playing had anything to do with him entering the draft. And he said, quote, I never really had a thought of me going to play with my dad, unquote. Bronny, you are a liabetic. You are suffering from diabetes. The only reason you got drafted was because your dad runs the Lakers. He runs the league. He wanted to play with his kid. So Bronny's agent who is also, of course, dad's agent. He called all around telling people not to draft Bronny because he'd go play in Australia if he didn't get to play with his dad. So for Bronny to be so disingenuous to say, quote, I never really had a thought of going to play with my dad. Craig Carton's right. That is why people don't like the James family. Like I said, more and more of that going on. Three of Southern Cal's top four scores didn't get drafted to play in the NBA. And Bronny averaged 4.6 points per game, could barely get off the bench, and he got drafted. I mean, this is obvious Nepo baby stuff. It should be made fun of and criticized universally. But... LeBron runs the NBA, he runs the Lakers, and people are scared to death of him. I think the whole thing's a joke. If I were Bronny, I'd be embarrassed. Because daddy got him a job he don't deserve. Let's go to Brady in Pittsburgh. Brady, you're on with Double M. Hey, Mark. How are you? Great. Uh, I just wanted to let you know that Bronny James is 10 times the athlete you are or ever will be. Well, that's okay. Uh, that's great. But, but here's the, here's the difference. Here's the difference. I didn't get my opportunities based on daddy. I've been always good enough to do what I do. Bronny's not good enough, but, but daddy got him in the NBA and he'll have to look himself in the mirror for the, his entire life and say, I don't deserve it. Daddy got it for me. Now, you don't sound like you're educated and probably have done nothing in life, so you can't relate to either me or Bronny, but do you see what I'm saying here? Hello. Yeah, that figures. Mark Man.